Hello and welcome to our playthrough of Are You Done Chronicle? I'm your boy LF Jake and this is episode 17. Last episode we journeyed to Eucris and we finally made it. We met it with Periel who was hanging out in the tavern and I think we were looking around the palace but I quickly ran back to the tavern to save it. So first things first we must go back to the palace. Are you doing anything special there? Try uh, Take a walk in the palace courtyard okay. Maybe we're going to see something, something. Just here on the left on this bridge, right? Is it Periel? Oh no. Who are you? Say, uh, you're the fellow from the Alliance, right? Uh, don't get me wrong, I, I wasn't eavesdropping on the conference. I just, uh, ha happened to catch that one little part. <laughs> huh? Who are you? Oh, oops. <laughs> Silly me. Um, I'm Yulin, King Yuma's handmaid. So, um, please don't think ill of his majesty. I know people call him indecisive, but they've got him all wrong. He's a very kind ruler, you see, and he worries about making decisions that lead to people getting hurt. Oh. Okay, I was expecting some, uh, some actual information there. There's no point going to the top left, right? There's not going to be any treasure there. I feel like there's no treasure chests anywhere other than, like, dungeon areas. I mean, there's random people I can talk to that sometimes give me stuff in these towns. But I don't feel like there's any treasure chests that I'm going to find. But I have to check now, because I could be wrong. I don't think I'm wrong. I would have a can here as well. Nothing. Not a sausage. Alright, never mind. Let's walk along in the courtyard and see who else we can have a NASA with. Where are we going? To the bottom right. Also, I keep talking to people who have got names. But they won't join me. Oh. Ah, oh, see? I mean, even at least Yulin had a, uh, a voice actor. Your name is Noah, yes? Of course I know you. Anyone would. Anyone would if they knew a little about what's really going on. My name is Saeed Ali. I'm travelling on a quest just like you. I'm sure our paths will cross again. Oh, okay, bye. That's, I thought that was the end of the conversation too, yeah. No. That's a normal time to end a sentence and walk away. What a strange man. Oh wait, have we followed the handmaid to talk to her more? Oh no, it's just Perry. Where on. have you been? We should return to the inn at once so I can continue brooding about a solution to this problem. Chill, welcome to the stream and thank you for the tier one sub. You are greatly appreciated. More than you know. Do you think there even is a solution? Well, I guess we could... Wait, no, sorry, I got nothing. Countess Periel, His Majesty <laughs> Yuma is here to speak with you. May I open the door? She's gonna join us, right? Of What's course. your voice actor? Please, enter. Hello, Periel. I had a little extra time and was hoping I could see you. I'm most pleased you've come to visit. I only wish it could have been for one of our usual goodwill summits, instead of this most unfortunate situation. Oh, um, yes, of course. I'm terribly sorry about your country. Is Groom supposed to be a country? I thought it was just like a little... I don't know. A little area. I don't know. Dave, Your name is Noah, yes? Did you rise up to fight for Periel's sake? Uh. 
Also the top one. I rose up to stop the Empire. Oh, you don't say. Not for me? Oh, such a pity. I really don't want this romance to be a thing. I, don't, I can't see Periel and Noah. I just can't see it. Huh? But never mind that, Yuma. Let me ask you something. Not as the Countess of Groom, but as someone you've known since we were both small. What do you intend to do? Will you fight? Or will you place your trust in Dukes Aldrich? Well, I, uh, I just... The truth is, um, I don't know what the right choice is. If you stay the course your advisors are laying for you, you Chris will be at the Empire's mercy. No, worse, at the Duke's. But if we fight and lose, my people will fare far worse. Perhaps, um, the Duke's made a mistake in attacking your country. If so, you could maybe still talk it out? <sighs> uh, your Majesty, you're gonna be late for your next... Oh, is it that time already? I'm sorry, Periel. We'll continue this later. Countess Grum, Commander Noah, I bid you both good day. I like Cassius. Cassius is very cool. Ugh, same old Yuma. He never changes. We need to find some way to help make up his mind. Come on, people. Ideas. Uh, sorry, but I'm not much of an ideas man. Hmm. Nope, still nothing. But let's think while we walk. Maybe some exercise will knock a good idea loose. Not the worst plan I've ever heard. Wait. Oh, Periel has to join, okay. Uh, what level is she? She's level 30. I don't want to swap out any of my lower level guys, so she'll be an attendant. If I must. I still don't know what being attendant means, but she's there. She can't join the battle and she doesn't benefit the team in any way, I don't think. Actually, you know what? Why why not know when we could know? Okay, no, that's not okay. I mean, it'd be, it wouldn't be in battle, right? But it wouldn't be in basic controls. Would it not be in party formation? Oh! Sorry, I'm just stupid. The party is for the front and rear support and attendance. The front and rear are the ones who do the fighting. Some allies are supports instead, providing support in combat. Attendants are always locked into your party and won't fight. So I think they're just here to join the party. In case I need someone for like the story, I can just have them join the party but not be a part of the uh, the fighting team. But just to double check. Can I just swap people from attendance? What am I doing? I'm on the wrong menu. Can I swap people from the attendance tab into the team? No. Okay. So if you get put in the attendance slot, you literally just can't move. You're just here for the ride. Which makes sense, I guess. It's a good way to get people who need to be in the story in the team, but also still have my lowest level team out. I don't know where I'm going now. We're just going for a walk, but... I'm going all the way over here. This guy looks like a guy, you know? This is no ordinary guy right here. <laughs> That's some good booze. Tastes even better on a day like this. Excuse me, are you the famous spearman Ryufan? I heard talk of your exploits in town. Did I? Apparently I well, did. Well, if the likes of you have heard of me, then I suppose I must be famous. I am currently seeking stalwart companions. Can I interest you in joining the Alliance? 
<laughs> you wish to be companions, lad. I don't suffer fools who are weaker than I. If you wish to face me and find Ooh. out if that includes your sorry self, well... I accept. Ah, normally I'd give you a thrashing, oh. lad, but I'd hate to see you trip and twist a finger or something. Come back when you're less of a weedy runt. Now, is he talking to Noah in general there, or is it my current team is at a high enough level? Because I've got higher level people, you know? I assume he's talking about Noah. Oh, hello. Huh. Huh. Is there any reason you're staring? Yeah. Did you just materialize out of thin air? Did I miss what? Miscalculate? How dare you! That's not at all what I said. You listen to me, Buster. I don't make mistakes because I'm perfect with a sparkly, pristine capital P. Whatever you think you saw, you didn't. Right? Uh. Um. Right. That's more like it. Don't you ever question a paragon. Oh. And she's gone. Okay. <laughs> what a weird scene. <laughs> Perhaps we will see them again in the future. Huh? <laughs> What's this place? Oh. Guests, is it? How unusual. I remember you from the conference earlier. Please, come in, come in. I see, I see. You seek some method of swaying his majesty. But why would you bring this matter to me? Because you were the one who stood up to Harlan at the conference. Uh, yep, you were all like, but riddle me this, jerk, and then everyone got distracted and nothing was settled. <laughs> yes, I suppose I did do something along those lines. I admit to being less than thrilled with the prospect of giving Lord Harlan free reign to transform our relationship with the Empire. Agreed. We cannot permit Dukes Aldrich to have his way on this. Lord Harlan has been advocating for cuts to the studium. Should he gain too much power, I might find it hard to continue living in the comfort to which I've become accustomed. You don't say. Noah, are you even listening here? This guy's just in it for himself! Correct. Not that merely whittling away Lord Harlan's power will change much in the long run. Your name is Noah, yes? Well, there may be a way to change things if a person was so inclined. Countess, did you know Lord Harlan purchased an old manor on the outskirts of town last year from another member of the Chamber of Lords? He's apparently so fond of it that he made it his primary residence. Well, bully for him. What of it? I hear the manor has recently seen quite the stream of... Unfamiliar faces hailing from foreign lands. I wonder if some might be messengers from the Empire. At the same time, security around the manor has been tightened to the extent that actual Eucrisians are rarely allowed inside. So, uh, this matters why? He's implying that Lord Harlan bought a manor on the outskirts of town in order to meet secretly with foreign agents. Lord Harlan, a spy? That does Question indeed one? sound very suspicious. And one more thing. On the southeast side of Haishan, you'll find an old part of the city known as Lost Town, which was flooded out long ago. That'll be the dungeon area that I've got to get through. While Harlan's house of mystery may be under tight guard, one could easily slip in by way of Lost Town, were they so inclined. How do you know all that? Oh, I've been poking around for holes in the man's armor for some time now. This guy is incorrigible. 
So you're suggesting we sneak into Harlan's manor and search for evidence linking him to the Empire? I'm suggesting that if one were to find such evidence, it could be a breakthrough in terms of the pending alliance negotiations. While I am not fond of proposing tenuous plans, sometimes needs must. I understand completely, Melridge. Tenuous certainly beats sitting on a sofa and doing nothing. Be aware that Lost Town is said to be infested of with monsters. Anyone heading there should take all necessary precautions. We'll be careful. Thanks. I'm ready. It's been a while since we did some adventure. You said Lost Town is on the southeast side of the city, yes? Uh, yup. Now let's go dig up some dirt on Harlan. Yeah. Let's see how noble he feels when we're done with him. I think you might be losing sight of our objective here. The thing is, what if he's not corrupt or a spy? What if he's just a dude that is smart? Like, the Empire seems like a big old scary nation, not someone that you want to really tangle with. So we are going, okay, all the way down there to the right. Now I am still using my weakest team. And uh, the journey here with my old weakest team was a little bit scary. I'm going the wrong way. So this could be uh, even scarier. But as long as we can win one or two fights, we should fly up in levels. By the runes guiding light, magical girl Malor is coming to get ya! What's that chest? Why is there an open chest there that I can't interact with? Get him, boys! 108 damage, you say? Missed, good job. Uh, we'll fight this time because I want. Oh, here it comes. We got nothing fancy. Uh, so we'll have mixed healing herbs on Leon, and we'll do healing drops on Leon. Might mean nothing if this monster attacks me out again. Oh, no. We'll all get one hit killed. I wanted everyone to be alive at the end of this fight, so we all got experience. How much do we get? Not bad. Should get a few levels here. I feel stronger. Sorry, my lord. Still very scary, especially because I don't have a lot of healing items. At least in the tree folk village I could always run back there and use the tavern to heal, but I can't do anything like that here. A little bit too far away. Hushan for Haishan, Old Town. This must be Lost Town. Lost is putting it mildly. The heck happened here? There was a terrible disaster years and years ago. It was long before my time, so I don't know the details. So if we make our way through this place, we'll be able to sneak into Harlan's Manor? Uh, yep, or that's what Professor Smarty Pants said, at least. Is that Harlan's Manor over there on the right? Okay. It's a big barrel. Am I? Am I crazy? <laughs> There's nowhere to go. Unless I've got a... Oh. 
Oh, wow. Okay. That's going to make this place nice and challenging. Another little puzzle area. Left is probably wrong, so we'll go there for the treasure. I just hate resorting to violence. Let's fight normally. Hopefully, that don't do too much damage. Uh, you can attack because you're going to do a big deal this time. We're doing decent damage. Let me hear I'm not gonna waste any items reviving Leon. We should win the fight with auto from here. Stunned. Amazing. Last one. Good job, team. At least my law survives. I still get to catch up. Very good. I feel stronger. I do feel like even Noah is still getting a decent amount of experience. So we're all a little bit under leveled for this area. Oh, shrimp. Nice. I'm thinking maybe level 30, 31 is where we all want to be. To be uh, less scared in this area. Well, now what? I don't see a way forward. Easily slip in my foot. The good scholar needs to get his facts straight. There's really no way through? We've got to figure something out here. I'm thinking of we need to look for outside help here, guys. Wait. They're not suggesting we go back and find another companion who knows what they're doing. Are they? Huh. By the rune's guiding light? Magical girl Malore is coming to get ya! Oh! Deals damage to all enemies, 60 MP. Yeah, go on then. Oh, yeah, I'll do things with me on. Well done, Noah. You're a hero. Out of here. Are you all right? Let me heal him. 40 HP is nothing. <laughs> Consider how much damage these guys are doing. Question is, can we kill these three? I mean, these two. Don't overdo it. Thanks. Fight, fight. Uh, yeah. Oh my god. I think so. So close. No. Stop it. No one died. Let's go. Yeah, 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 yeah. We get a decent amount of here as well. We already won. Decent. Very good. I just keep getting better. Very good. No, I don't know where I'm going. There is a cat over there. Uh, when she says, let's look for outside help, does she mean the local wildlife? I actually not. I actually can't get back. <laughs> because I've knocked the barrel in the water. What am I missing here? 
There's got to be something else we can do, right? I'm not going to survive if I keep on getting into random fights like this. I hate resorting to violence. You're getting it now. Gotcha. Don't overdo Thanks. it. Oh. Damn it! Whoa! Uh, not good. We're fine. Come on! Yeah, 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 yeah. Don't overdo Thanks. it. Thanks! Evil must fall! Nothing to write home about. Alright, so now we're in front of both level 30. Powered up. We're, we're on the cusp of being a normal level for this area. Which uh, we might get if we get forced to stay here and keep on fighting. There's got to be something I can interact with, right? Like the... uh, oh. We can't do this on our own. We need outside help. Wow. Can you not think of anyone who might aid us? Oh God, it's really telling me to to get help. But how do we leave? Oh wait, how do we get out? Am I missing something here? Let's do this. Uh, yeah. I forgot her name, but I do love how the herb girl heals, even when I auto bell. I tried to pride myself on remembering everyone's name, but I'm sad at myself for forgetting her name. Don't Is there a K in it? I think there's a K in her name. I could be completely wrong. Marin, okay, yeah, completely wrong. Let's go. Ooh, 102 damage. That's good. You're wide open. <laughs> we already won. Five hundred XP per fight is still a lot. So I still want to get a level or two above where I am right now. Uh, how? Oh, thank God. Okay. So we'll save it again. God knows where the game wants us to go here. I assume we've got to run back to Haishan. But I'm very confused. Like, the game was... Find a way past the sunken part of the old city. But there's definitely no like clue about who I should speak to. I mean, at least I get to heal here, so. Swings and roundabouts. Uh, we've got Drunken Man over here. We are a little bit stronger. <laughs> Let's see if he'll give us the time of day. I'm actually going to go heal first, because if he does scrap us like he says he wants to and we lose that scrap would that be a game over I don't even think of these two these two might help us honestly I might scrap the old uh, the old rule and constantly swap out the weakest I'm not sure if I did, who would who would make way? It would be one of my level 30s. Or level 25s. I don't know if I should, because... I'll constantly be in a state of trying to catch up with levels. Really? You know what? No. I, I want to do it. I want to do it. 
So, Leanne, Periel, and Noah need to be involved. But let's see who the weakest guys are in the team first. 27. Tell me how to help. 26. Perfect. You caught me when I was warmed up. 25. Huh. Could be fun. 26. Think of all the exciting places we will see. So they're all guys below level 28. And then out of the level 28s, we've got Gar. You coming too, Sabine? I mean, it's got to be Mio, right? We'll continue the journey together. And then... Well, these three have Always to be involved. To oh, will I be traveling with... We'll show them what the watch is made of. Increase, increase food. Increases allies' attack and action speed. Yeah, that's just the best one, isn't it? Yeah, we'll do it. Oh, and then we'll hit another save. Every time I'm matting in, I'm gonna swap. And sometimes, I don't know. No, every time we're matting in, we'll swap. Hmm. Please handle the meeting. Would you like to change your retinue in the meantime? Oh. Thanks. But no thanks. Who do I talk to? I mean, we'll, we'll obviously... We'll talk to the drunk guy. Ah, I'm stuck in a tree. Oh, Jesus. That was scary. Ah, normally I'd give you... Yeah. Hmm... There's no quest markers. I don't even know if the game wanted me to come back here. Uh, what's over to the right? I guess we'll pop over and have a look. Are we just oh, we are just leaving the town. Good. Oh. Ah. Oh. I think we found our help. You again? Really? I hope you're not following me. Of course not. But are you all right? That looks like a nasty... I didn't fall. You skinned your knee. Look. I didn't fall, okay? So... Oh, yeah. That's... That's pretty gross. Hey, you listen to me. My teleportation is flawless. I'm flawless, okay? Impervious to error. Which means you didn't see a thing. All right? All right. All right? Of course you didn't, because I don't make mistakes. Okay, but... No! I think we need her teleportation. Oh, I don't know where she would have gone to now. Um, we do have a commodity shop. I think I've already been to this person. Oh, price is now up on the same items. I. Oh man, I did. I 100% said. Remember how much I sold them for, and I don't remember how much I sold them for. 97, 98. Anything near 100 is not even worth it. Before I bought things, they were 85% reduced. I think that's the only time I'll, I'll, I'll take a chance. This guy looks fancy. How's that? The Alliance seeks to hire a culinary mind. Huh. I was just about to say, it looks like a chef. Intriguing thought. Alas, I'm already on a mission to find a recipe for the legendary dish known as Grill Tatuva. I'm told the people who devised it are all bark and, um... Well, that's it, actually. All bark. Whatever could that be referring to? Dogs. Tutava is dog food. And that's all it's going to give me for information. Okay. Oh. I know you saw me mess that one up. 
I wasn't nice. really looking. Yes, you were. Don't lie. You saw my other blunders, too. What? It's okay. I haven't sold anyone. Good. Because I was prepared to teleport you to the nether regions of the world if you had. Huh? <clears throat> well, you've seen what you've seen, and there's no taking it back. Therefore... I must keep you under surveillance and ensure the secret is kept. Surveillance? That's right. And know this. No matter what corner of the world you run to, I will find you. There is no escape from Carrie. Yay! <laughs> Teleporter Chaos Girl. My uh -huh. hawk-like watch begins now. You will rue having caught me at a moment of sub perfection. Of course, you can still call on me at any time to demonstrate my flawless teleportation abilities. You do have a. What's it called? A map. Yes? <gasps> just open your map, point to a destination, and I'll take you there in one perfect blink. Did I just unlock fast travel? Oh, and you should hold on to this. If I'm not around, this ring will achieve more or less the same thing. Don't misplace it. Now I'll be able to keep an eye on him. Teleportation, huh? I wonder if it would help us cross that place we got stuck. Oh my god. First of all... How do I... I guess I can't bring up the map while I'm here. As if this woman has just gave me the means to teleport. Like that's a normal thing. Have I forgotten what tele what the map button is? I thought it was touchpad. Let me just double check. I'm pressing all the different square. But I still can't select places on the map. By the looks of things. Oh! But perhaps I can. Oh my god. I am a teleportation professional. Incredible. Is this the right uh I mean this is the right place. Yes. Thank you, Carrie. Seems a bit cheap that they just gave me a, a ring of teleportation. I don't understand if we like helped her with anything, but we didn't help her with anything. She just we saw her fall over, and she was like, "Oh no, you saw me fall over. Have this ring of teleportation." I won't complain. I'm just glad to be back on the move. Oh wait, I need to rearrange my team. Uh, so while at your long range, Mio's short range. Everyone else here is short range. Incredible. So, I assume we go back to here where the gang was stuck and we can teleport from here. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we're not going to be able to get past this on our own. I guess we'll need to bring along someone who can help. Don't say this to me. No, I've got the ring. I've got the ring of teleportation. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> I guess we'll need to... Don't say this to me. Not like this. Not like this. Okay, luckily, <laughs> through the power of teleportation, I can't teleport right now. Very good. <laughs> Very good. Okay, so I need to bring Carrie along. Which is a bit annoying, because I thought all I had to do was have the ring. Challenge accepted. Can't give me a ring of teleportation. I'd be like, oh, sorry, can't use it. Why is Mio on low health? You pay in blood. Good hit. Good one. Holy crap, Gar. Go. 
Gar's my most OP character. By far. Doesn't matter that he's one of the lowest levels. The damage he does and the damage he receives is crazy. We're done here. Not even worth sullying my blade. And now, because we're lower level. Nice. Experience is strength. Sorry, Mia. New runes for a bunch of people. Okay, so I need to get out of this dungeon area. And then I can fast travel back to the town. Go to the tavern. Recruit. Carry. Uh, and then fast travel back. <laughs> Good God. Uh, luckily, it's the... the the last I have place literally on the list. Never failed at this. Not once. Here we go. There's not a chance she fails, right? And I get sent somewhere else. Hmm. Perfect. As usual. What if what if I keep on fast traveling and eventually it just sends me to a random town I've never been to? Alright, uh so to the tavern. And whoever the highest level person is in the team right now? Has to make way. Make way for carry. Uh, form the party first. So I didn't realize. Oh, who's the highest level? She can't be. Okay. A shame. Carry can't be a, a support or anyone. It is technically. Carathor. You know me. Oh. So, I need to make sure we always rest after we change the team, because there's people that aren't in the team right now that aren't fully healed. Okay. Exactly, Kiriko. Like an aeroplane crash. They say aeroplanes are safer than crossing the road. But that's because a lot more people cross the road. Uh, what am I doing? Square. Square's a weird button to bring up the map, right? I'm not crazy in thinking that, right? All right. All right. All right. Sorry, Carrie. I have no time for gossip now. Hmm. In fact, I've got no time for anything. Gang, we are about 45 minutes in. This is going to be the end of this episode. I mean, we've done some stuff. A lot of it's been talking. We've done literally nothing combat related. A lot of back and forths and a lot of talking. But this has been episode 17 of our Are You Done Chronicle 100 Heroes playthrough. I hope you've enjoyed it. I will see you soon. I've been your boy, I'm Jake. Don't go changing. Ciao for now.